Yesterday, Google rolled out the Android 12 Beta 4.1 update to Pixel devices. If you have not installed the update already, you can do so now by going to the Settings application, scrolling down, tapping on System, scrolling down again to tap on System Update, and then checking for your update there. The update is rather small for my Pixel 4a. It was only a few megabytes in size. But once installed, you should be given a number of bug fixes. A lot of bugs were fixed in this update that were pretty critical, including a fix that caused some devices to get stuck in a boot loop simply by restarting the device. This was a big issue if you experienced that before that is now fixed. The update also fixed an issue where heads up notifications were sometimes not shown and it required the user to swipe into the notification drawer just to see them. It also fixed an issue where the device volume controls sometimes did not work when you were casting audio or video. It also fixed an issue where face unlock did not work on some devices. A big issue that a number of people were seeing was this update fixed an issue that prevented users from granting the nearby devices permission to the phone application via the settings. Users who are experiencing a application crash loop with the phone application when you're trying to make a call over Bluetooth can now do so. However, unless you do a factory reset, you're going to need to long press on the phone application, tap on the app info option, then go into permissions, nearby devices, and change that permission to allow before that application crash will be fixed. And lastly in this update, another big bug that was fixed was an issue that after connecting the phone to a VPN, the phone could not connect to the internet. This is a big bug that affected a lot of people after the big Android 12 beta 4 update. And that has all been fixed in the 4.1 update that was just rolled out. Now there are still some known issues with the Android 12 beta in general. I'll be including a link to these in the video description so that you can read over them. The update itself is rather stable now, so these other issues tend to be rather minor. But for anyone who's wanting to read into it before you update to Android 12, again, I'll be including that in the video description below. So those are all of the changes that are included in the Android 12 4.0 update that was just rolled out. The company is getting very close to an official Android 12 release. I'm reading the next update will be an RC update, a release candidate, meaning a lot of the other bugs that are still present should be ironed out as the operating system becomes even more stable for the final release.